Hey guys, so I just wanted you all to know that this lease is now available for purchase. So I've got it on my website, which is helloe2e.com, which stands for Hello Entrepreneur to Entrepreneur. And it's very simple. It's actually on Microsoft Word. I did it myself and you can manually go in and edit so you can change your name as the landlord. You can change your tenant's name as the leasee. You can change the duration of the contract and the amount for your rent. And as always, I will be here if you guys need any support. So yeah, let's get into today's video. We're gonna do a lease for my new tenants. Okay, so just a quick story time here. Like my previous lease that I done, I just literally drafted it up with my friend. Like we didn't have any professional help at all. We just done it on our own. Um, and a huge shout out to that friend if you're watching, babe and this new lease that i need to do i've had to get legal help because my previous tenant overstayed their welcome in the property so the day that the lease ended and the day that they're supposed to move out they um they didn't move out and we were in the process of starting a court case against them to get them out of the property so because of that obviously i've had to send the lease over to lawyers for them to overlook it and kind of like see what we can and can't do with the situation and i've got i'll give you guys one advice because i've got a bigger plan for you guys later on which you should subscribe to be a part of um so one advice is if you're a landlord overseas like myself you should make sure that within your lease contract you state that the eviction notice so following um the termination of this lease and your tenant still hasn't evacuated the property you need to have a clause in your lease agreement which basically says that an eviction notice is acceptable via email via whatever mediums that you use email text mailman because standard leases um they usually don't include those and obviously with the pandemic and with long distance and so many other things it's not normally always feasible to actually give your tenants the eviction notice in their hand for me i actually had an issue and usually you have a window so you have a specific time frame in which you need to hand over that lease so make sure that you amend that in your contract to make sure that it suits your needs so for this new contract that i'm about to draft up I'm going to definitely put in a new clause which will basically say that should the tenant overstay their welcome in the property so move out the gun, lease lapse, you know what in a short term um, agreement so you know month to month contract should I give you the if it comes to the point where I need to give you the notice by email because I'm overseas or I'm traveling or whatever then that is acceptable in court if you have a lease that says that the only way the eviction notice is acceptable is through giving them in their hand giving them the lease in their hand or yeah that's normally the only way them lease are jamaica get the lease in your hand for some answer if you only have that and you're the overseas that is the only valid thing that you can put in court like that is the only that is the only thing that the judge is going to look at you're going to have to make sure that them actually get the eviction notice in them and you understand what i say but if you want to work smart so you said them can't accept it through emails as long as them accept it through email you don't say yeah we can't go to court because you get the eviction notice so that's one thing that i wanted to mention with you guys i'm just drafting up the lease now i learned that word I'm watching one of my favorite things, which is Julie's Top 5. If you don't know, go look on YouTube, but you'll probably like it too. If you love music, you'll love it.
really want to get the Charlotte, Charlotte, Charlotte Tilbury setting spray. Like, girl, what do you think? I want to get it just to treat myself. At the end of January, at least. Every day I do something good for myself. I know it's getting toxic now because for my account, she tired of me. to do more landlord videos for you guys if you guys have any suggestions or topics that you want me to cover make sure that you leave it in the comment section below and as always thank you guys so much for supporting me my storage is running out now